I want to quickly speak to you guys about something about the major problem that we actually have in our Pakistani culture. It's this. <laughs> See, I don't understand who this guy is. I don't understand what's going on in his life. I don't know as to what he is. I don't understand why they've labelled him a so-called beard. This guy basically goes around and goes, shoo, shoo, and apparently he could cure people. Really? If he was that amazing, that much of a curable person, I think he should be going to every single hospital all around the world and blowing in every person and making sure they have no illnesses in life. Apparently, his dad or granddad or somebody in his relatives was a very knowledgeable wise person so it's all about chinese whispers basically one day i could turn around and say hey guess what i was related to somebody and guess what you know what i'm one of these people now as well this is the problem that we have in our own pakistani culture this is especially why we are or there's loads of people that label these people bravely you understand the reason why is because of people like this guy right there it's a disgrace as to how can he believe that somebody by Placing your hand in your head, he's gonna blow on you, it could be totally fine. And you hand him some wallets. Hand him some of your wallet. It doesn't make no sense. Are people really need to start waking up and realizing the more you follow and believe in people like this, the more you're going away from your own belief. Do yourselves a favor and understand one small little thing. If this guy was really that good, if this guy was really that pious, would he really be taking your money? And would he really believe deep down inside? That by blowing on people is going to make them better. And a lot of the time, I'm telling you this. The people that are actually not well and all of a sudden are back together right after he blows at them. It's all staged. Stop believing in people like this. This guy's a curse to our community. <laughs>